in the name of Allah, the most merciful and most kind. My YouTube family, friends, brothers, sisters, viewers, peace be upon you all. Today I am going to share very beautiful and very important video and message with you. As you could see, it's hot season, hot weather in Pakistan and in hot countries, the temperature reaching 45 degrees centigrade in end of May. In summer time, in July, August time, the temperature reached from 50 to 55 degrees centigrade, which is burning. Nowadays, what is uh, fashion? People are building solid houses. The mud made house fashion is finished. Nobody want the mud made house, wood made house. Everybody want to put lanterns. Everybody want to put uh, chipsum, marbles on the ground. And the hotter weather become more hotter unbearable so there is very limited for fashion they just uh, put some plants and the rest of all they just make a solid the problems caused when is a heavy rain problem caused when is windy when is dust and when is uh, hot weather there is no fresh air there is no uh, air circulation there is no light and there is no open plan living areas. And when you go out and about in a parks, in a green uh, areas, in farms, in fields, you feel so relaxed, happy and calm. Why? Because any heat coming from skies, from sun, the plants absorb it, absorb it and produce you coolness like you keep umbrella or the wood made and earthy kind of things protect you from harmful rays of sunshine and you feel protected cooler and better when you don't care you just listen whatever you want and then it's just a turn uh, like a uh, hot weather if you're sitting in AC room, air condition system room, and when you get out, your face start burning, your body start burning, and you feel very upset. And then you rush again towards uh, AC because you used to live in there. Then if you stand behind the AC, there is lots of heat, lots of uh, warmness coming out. So why not you start living uh, in a room temperature why not you try to tolerate now i'm bringing you the solution of all these problems some people own some lands and they have beautiful gardens fruit trees and some crops in their garden if they have one acre or five acres or ten acres first of all they have hundreds of fruit trees which produce them fresh organic fruit all year round they don't have to buy because they've got land they grow their own fruit then they have a shade underneath the shade they sit in the summer around the house it naturally become cool they have oranges in a winter they have mangoes in summer time they have a pineapples they have bananas they have limes they have a, a all sort of fruit and vegetables growing in their own fields even they keep their buffaloes their goats their hens in the greenhouse it just recycle everything all together and they make most out of it because this life is very temporary if you have your own house at least three to 
five trees every body must grow in their house depend of the size of the house if they cannot afford big trees at least five little plants five six feet high they need to have so there is a fresh oxygen beautiful greenery make your eyes cool uh, clean the air as well as produce you fresh oxygen and fresh fruit this is the need of the time everybody is complaining is uh, eggs are very expensive uh, meats are very expensive milk is expensive vegetables are expensive fruit is expensive because people stop working hard everybody sitting on their ass doing nothing they just want to have nice food uh, to eat all the time nobody uh, bother to dirty their hands and clothes nobody willing to work in the fields some people do work in the fields when they bring the their fruit and vegetables to the brokers and <coughs> they do not value their fruit and vegetables this they discourage the farmers and lots of farmers do suicide die because of, of their uh, expenses they have families they work hard 24/7 and do not uh, can uh, live life uh, um, well at all they are under uh, the pressure of loan they have to return loss of loan which they are uh, borrow from government or banks or from people so they can have crops and then they going to sell the crops and have uh, food so my question is why our parents and grandparents used to work so hard live very simple life eat very simple uh, food and wear very simple clothes live in mud made house but stress free life they do not have a uh, cancers they do not have a um, depression they do not have a, so many other uh, pressures because they were close to the earth because they was close to nature because they had organic food to eat no sprays and no chemicals and no uh, artificial things they just eat pure simple but nowadays we are um, not doing that if you see there are oranges even in the summer this is a two days video i'm showing you i'm just inviting you to plant at least one person need to plant one tree and if the person want to get continue charity continue rewards they can uh, plant at least 10 trees not just planting in one time is important looking after the, the plants uh, until they keep get, getting a fruit if we like to eat fruit we need to grow more trees if we want to eat fresh uh, vegetables we need to grow some vegetables we need to do ourselves and if we want to drink milk pure milk we need to keep buffaloes and cows and sheep and goats if we want to eat fresh poultry uh, meat of our own uh, um, hens then we need to keep the chickens at home and we need to have a fresh uh, eggs everyone who is in this world they can live very closely very easily in the uh, peace in a peace with a uh, close to nature the people used to uh, survive in cottages in a um, um, wood made uh, kind of a chapar is called cottage and they used to live in a mud made house you know what if you live in mud made house the house is 20 degree to 10 degree cooler in a summer and warmer in a winter if you made a, a, with the mud this is the reality and why you turn a, a fan all the time air condition system all the time and paying and complaining the bills why not you get close to the nature
people used to have have a hand f- uh, fan whenever they f- used to have a heat they just uh, used to give them a uh, air and they used to feel fresh they having exercise their arm bit is a uh, uh, having breathing as well so they no, no sweating and they have g- good uh, nowadays it call himmat fan uh, nobody bother to use that people uh, rather than using uh, plastic plates they used to uh, eat uh, in chabiya in a uh, straw made uh, plates and they used to be very happy these uh, chapatis stay warm and uh, sweat free if you keep in a uh, chabiya in uh, the handmade things i always look for nature and uh, ask you all to get close to nature if you want to be healthy if you want to be relaxed if you want to be calm we all have to go back to basic 100 years ago how the people used to live without electricity without internet with, without uh, uh, this uh, kind of technology we need to start living and adopting that if we want uh, um, our bills don't uh, get higher and we don't get get um, in pressure these are look so beautiful cherries growing in pakistan even do you have a one little jar you can uh, put at least 3 4 uh, plants like this and your house going to look beautiful you going to have a fruit you going to have a relax uh, summer and you going to be feel proud of you all the time whenever you see your hand uh, planted uh, plants and you eating the their own fruit like if you work hard for something and when you get it you feel very fortune and very rewarded grateful same if you plant your vegetables and fruit with your hand promise when you going to eat you going to feel very proud of you very happy very relaxed and very healthy as well so i think uh, this message is enough for all of you please plant more trees if you want to park your car underneath the uh, shade of the trees so it do not become hot we need to plant some trees if we want to have uh, coolness when is no electricity under the trees and the birds need to have somewhere to live they can't build houses and mansion like us they need to live somewhere and all insects need to uh, survive as well be kind or to allah's uh, world and allah going to be kind with you so be merciful upon mankind and allah going to be merciful upon you allah did not change the situation of the people who do not bother to change their own situation i hope you have enjoyed my channel if you like my channel please subscribe to desi bb uk and share it with your family and friends and write down in comment section what you think of my um, videos are like or what you want to see and how you feel and i hope my message reached to you you going to pl- uh, plant a tree or trees for you and for your beloved one and you going to have continue ch- charity and you going to make your life heaven make the heaven on the earth so you going to get heaven in here after make other people's life easier as well as yours and allah almighty going to be merciful upon you and make your life easy thank you for watching see you soon thank you bye